Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Disco Bob Entertainment. Ladies and gentlemen, he was a contestant on America's Got Talent 2018. Ladies and gentlemen, the one, the only, Disco Bob. Well, hello, everybody. <clears throat> How's everybody doing? I hope everybody enjoyed the videos. I, hey, like I said, welcome to Disco Bob Entertainment. And on Disco Bob Entertainment, you will actually get more than four seconds performance. You will actually get more than four seconds performance on Disco Bob Entertainment. Is that the truth or what? Yes, it is the truth. You will get more than four seconds. And, and fix your shirt. Your shirt is oh Well, well, you won't get any a Disco Law uh, Entertainment t-shirt. So, I gotta wear this old Grunzy t-shirt. Well, I don't have your size. We'll get your size. Okay. Uh, those are good videos you had today. With your car, your very new car, and the pumpkin festival. That's kind of why I didn't get to go to the pumpkin festival today. Well, you will get to go whenever, you know, next time. That wasn't fair. I wanted to go. Wiley Macy was there doing his review, doing his uh, uh, daily checkups on the food stands and all that stuff he got to do. So, I don't know. Uh, you're gonna have to let me go next year. That's all there is to it. You know, you just make me so mad sometimes in the things that you do. I know, I'm sorry. You know, you know, I went today and I wanted to do a video and uh, while, he, while, while he Macy was working, I, I came there and tried. So, uh, yeah, I hope everybody enjoyed them, those videos I did with the, um, with my car and my in the pumpkin festival so it was awesome I was little extra videos today you know so uh, I'm trying to build this channel up and uh, really really become something with this you know yes you will you know me you and I here are gonna become something so tell everybody out there what we're gonna be doing what I'm, what you're gonna be doing with me in November Tell everybody, this is exciting. You tell everybody what you're going to be doing in November with me. Tell them. I'm not going to tell them. It's your turn to tell them. You tell them. Okay. What he's getting in, what he's trying to say is in November, in November, I'm going to audition for AGT with Disco Law. I'm going to audition with him. So... He's, I'm going to be going with him to audition, plus he's going to do skate dancing. So, uh, I'm going to be joining him. So, that's the news. I'm going to join, and I'm going to try out for AGT too. Disco Law is going to try out, and he's going to do it, and I'm coming along with him. I'm going to try out too. So, how do you like those apples? Yeah, you're going to try out. So that's the news. So he's going to try out for me with me in November. So I'm going to try to um, get a combination of stuff that I do on this show. And I'm going to try to put my hat in just, just with this morning, just roller skating. I'm going to do my show. Disco Bob Entertainment. So um, <clears throat> we'll put Disco Bob Entertainment on the map, so to speak. Yes. Put it on the map, baby. Put it on the map. It belongs on the map. Disco Love Entertainment belongs on the map. And I hope Disco Love Entertainment gets more and it skyrockets. I hope it gets more than a four second performance. Don't you think so? Yes, I hope so too. I hope so. Because I want to become something myself. Yeah, maybe we need together. Maybe we can do it. You and I together. We can accomplish this. So 
that maybe you and I together can do this thing, you know? So that's what we're going to do. Me and him's going to audition together. <laughs> so hopefully you and I can get more than four seconds like I did last year. Yeah, that would be cool. But like I said, this is the last time I'm going to do it. You know, and uh, you'll be on your own. Go if you want to go next year. Yeah, I'm ready. I'm ready to go. I can't wait till November gets here because I'm gonna I'm gonna see if I'll, and we're gonna make it. We're gonna make it together. Yes, we're gonna do it together. We're gonna do it. Ah, we're gonna do it. Yes, we are gonna do it, man. We are gonna do it. That's all there is to it. Yep, we're gonna do it. So let's bring out um, Wiley Macy. Um, Robert A. brought the product. He's already been, he's gone. Late Saturday night, he's gone. So Wiley Macy's coming out next. So uh, he's going to bring out this product. So the review. All right. I hope he does bring out this. That was fun at the Funkin' Festival. I got all that Funkin' High. I got all that good, delicious stuff. So I'm going to keep trying out. It's really good. There's Funkin' Red. Pumpkin cookies, all that. Okay, it's it's enough. Let's go. Then your shirt. I'm gonna have to definitely give you a smaller shirt. That's all there is to it. Your shirt is a mess. You know, it needs a shrink. When you go out and audition with me, you're gonna dress up a little bit better than you did today. I will. Jeez. So new members, just a month away, man. You know, we got a lot of practice, you and I. Especially you. You got a lot of practicing to do. A lot. I know, we're going to have to practice. Yes. You mean you're going to have to practice. This is CJ Entertainment. No. Let's go. Bring out Wiley Macy. See you guys. Well, hello, everybody. I'm Wiley Macy. Um... I just got back from the pumpkin festival, and I tried everything. I tried the pumpkin cookies with delicious pumpkin pie, pumpkin ice cream. All that was all delicious. It was fantastically great. But Robert A. went to the store today, and he got these uh, white pumpkin pie flavored M&M's for Halloween. I'm going to give these a try. I'm not a big fan of M&M's. Um, not really a big fan of them. But I tried the pumpkin pie flavored ones. Let's see. Like I said, I'm not a big fan of M&M's. Yeah. Like I said, these are not very good. Um, if I was going to get regular M&Ms, I'd get the chocolate ones. But these uh, white chocolate, these white Pumpkin pie flavored M&M's. Definitely not good. They're not very good taste. Um, they're kind of rich. Um, I hate to not like them. I'm not really a big M&M fan anyway, but I prefer the chocolate over the, this pumpkin flavor. Nah. Some pumpkin stuff is good, ladies and gentlemen, but some pumpkin stuff isn't really that good. These, nah. I'll give these a three. I give them a three. Not good. Not good at all. I mean, I wouldn't turn my nose up at them, you know, but I'll give them a three. Um, they're just not good. Uh, to me, it's my opinion. I don't think these pumpkin flavored M&Ms are all that great. So, sorry everybody. There might be people that might disagree with me. Um, let me see how much this cost. Um, uh, I 
can't find them. Let's see how much these really cost. I'm looking at the receipt here. Here they are, dollar seventy eight for this for this bag, for this eight ounce bag, dollar seventy eight. It was actually a dollar seventy eight that was not spent very good. Robert A didn't do very good, but he brought it. I mean, it was an interesting product to bring, but a three. Uh, so, Disco Bob's going to go to a skating segment. Sorry, everybody, but I give these a three. Uh, this this failed as a pumpkin flavor. This failed. So, like I said, there was a lot of people who don't like pumpkin stuff. But I do like pumpkin stuff, but not these M&M's. No. Sorry, everybody. I gotta go. And you better watch yourself, everybody. Time to go for a skating segment. So long.
Hey everybody. Hope you enjoyed that. Out here. More than four seconds performance. I know I keep saying that, but I got more than a four second performance here. On Disco Bob Entertainment, you always do. Guaranteed. Have a good one, everybody. Thanks for your support. Thanks for watching. Disco Bob Entertainment.